Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Former Liverpool and Chelsea right back Glenn Johnson says he wouldn't be surprised to see Jurgen Klopp make a move. For Timo Werner because the Premier League and Champions League winning manager could get the flop firing again. The Reds lined up the former RB Leipzig attacker as their main forward target back in 2020 before deciding to pull the plug on a move. Werner would instead join Chelsea, where he would win the Champions League in his debut season at Stamford Bridge. But 12 months on, his time with the Blue seems to be dwindling towards a disappointing conclusion with Chelsea ready to sell. In the view of Johnson, he would not be surprised to see Liverpool launch a shock move for the 26-year-old. When asked if Werner would be a success at Anfield, Johnson told BettingOdds.com, I think he would. Has got a lot to offer. Just at Chelsea, from day one, has looked super, super low on confidence. Maybe someone like Klopp would make him smile and enjoy his football. If that was the case then I think has got a lot to offer and the way that Liverpool play then has going to get a lot of goal-scoring opportunities, has going to be fast on the break. So, yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. I think a lot of people will be shocked but I don't think it would actually surprise me. If Klopp can get him happy and smiling and confident then you're going to have a good player on. Your hands. Werner managed just four goals in 21 Premier League outings last season and is now being shown the door by Thomas Tuchel. The Chelsea boss is keen to upgrade his forward options as he goes in search of some extra firepower. Raheem Sterling is now set to join his new Chelsea team, mates in Los Angeles following his £45 million transfer from Manchester City. Chelsea have fallen short in their bid to sign Rafinha, however, after Barcelona up their offer for the Brazilian. The Blues are also in negotiations with AC Milan over the potential sale of Hakim Ziyech. He was also signed by Frank Lampard in the summer of 2020 and much like Werner has also failed to live up to expectations. It seems unlikely that Liverpool will make any changes to their attacking roster this summer though. They have already shelled out a club record £85 million, although the deal was only initially worth £64 million, to sign Darwin Nunez from Benfica. Luis Diaz is also relishing his first full season with the Reds after joining in January from Porto. Together, the pair are expected to fill the void left behind by Sadio Mane following his transfer to Bayern Munich.